now it is about hearing your heart now is about figuring out what your purpose is why you came here because the possibilities are infinite hey Izana. so serving the world through being yourself i really want to talk about this because i'm feeling for like the collective right now and the world right now and with everything that's going on when you get to the root of everything like when you uncover all of your traumas when you figure out every belief system that you hold when you figure out the the matrix system or whatever kind of system you want to call it, when you figure out that the societal programming and everything like that has been embedded in your mind, like literally when you peel back everything, when you uncover every single thing about yourself and about the world and about the systems that we live in and the construct of society right now, what are you left with? Like, what do you then need to do after that? Like, how do you empower yourself out of it? What does it mean? after that like where do you go next basically where do you go next once you've uncovered everything and i realized like we are in a time right now where you can literally do anything that you want like you can start your own business you can get online and make videos you can connect with people from the other side of the world like there's so much opportunity right now where we can literally do so many different things even from teaching the more spiritual perspective and understanding even from learning scientific things and how things how science has actually proven the spiritual things even from like learning a new skill like no matter what it is we're in such a time where we can do it all, you know, like there's so much opportunity right now. And I've realized that when you literally peel back all of these things, when you uncover everything and you understand the fuckery that goes on, what are you left with? And you're literally left with yourself and you're left with your purpose. Like why you came here, why did you come here kind of thing, you know, like, you can understand all of these external things, you can even understand your own internal struggle and the things that hold you back, which is obviously your own self, it's your own mind, but when you understand all of these different things within your own mind and within the external world, it still comes back to, okay, what do I do now? And I realise that it is about your purpose, you know? Because even when you understand all of these things, your purpose is still not done. You haven't lived out your purpose, otherwise you wouldn't need to be here in this world. So I really realised, like, it's about serving the world. It's about being of service, you know? Because money doesn't mean anything. Success doesn't mean anything. Beauty doesn't mean anything having like validation from other people doesn't mean anything because if you don't feel all of that stuff within yourself then you're not going to feel it when somebody else says it to you it's not going to stay you know it's not sustainable so like i realized that it's about being of service we're in such a powerful powerful time right now where we can be of service to so many more people than what you could be of like a thousand years ago or even a hundred years ago because we can reach people like you can reach so many more people now so like our purpose has been amplified to a bigger scale you know like the world has shifted people are reaching and have access to and have a platform to influence so many people now when they never expected that to happen or maybe they like don't feel deserving of it or maybe they don't actually have a righteous and moral message or influence to share with people but yet they've been given that platform and that power you see where i'm trying to go with this like there's so many people now that have influence in the world that I'm realising that no matter what scale you're at, no matter what it is that you do, no matter who you are, we all have that level of powerful influence now because, I mean, shit goes viral all the damn time when the person, like, wasn't famous or didn't have a huge platform or didn't expect it to and it goes viral. Like, everything 
that you put out there, somebody else can find, somebody else has access to it. So it's like, we all can reach so many people now that we literally have a duty of care almost of like being of service of being righteous like literally doing the right thing of standing up for things of like just putting out a good message you know like we all can influence each other so I don't know I just realized it's about being of service to be honest like this video is making me really anxious right now and it's going all strange in many directions but I just feel like now is really about being of service. Now it is about hearing your heart. Now is about figuring out what your purpose is, why you came here, because the possibilities are infinite, you know? And what's meant for you will always reach you. What your purpose is, it's yours and it's meant for you and you can live it and all of the opportunities and all of the steps that you need, all of the things that you feel like you lack and that's why you can't achieve it. Like all of those things will align for you at the right time in the right way so that you can live your purpose because that is why you're here. You can never not live it because your purpose is your experience. It's what you're here to do. So like it's such a powerful time right now and we can all follow our purpose. So I just really wanna encourage people to tap into themselves. <laughs> of course, I forgot to put it on silent. Tap into themselves, tap into who you are, tap into your heart, tap into your knowing, tap into your mind, tap into your intuition, like really just Feel your connection to the divine, like feel your connection to God or source or whatever you want to call it. But I'm literally talking about the thing that you were a part of, like what makes up this world, what brought us all into existence. Like feel your connection to your own heart, you know, that is the divine. That's where it lies, is in your own heart. And when we all feel that connection, this is such a fucking Pisces message, can I just say? But when we all, when we all feel that, when we all tap into that space, god damn, this whole world will shift and flip, you know? It's just about being of service. None of this other stuff matters. We're spending so much time trying to chase the goal, chase the relationship chase the perfect image and success and material shit like it don't mean anything that's not gonna bring you happiness just because you think that like once you get it you'll feel good like i think it's so evident to everybody that that doesn't mean anything and like even focusing on those things just keeps you in lack and keeps the right Thing, the right amount of money like the right opportunity the right relationship it keeps them away from you because you're focused on chasing instead of allowance what's meant for you can never miss you what's meant for you can never not come to you what's meant for you will always always be yours because it's a part of you because remember that this world like you're not this vessel, this world is run on frequency, you know, we are made up of electricity, we are made up of protons and neurons and electrons, like we are made up of it, that is what creates our vessel and it's also what our soul and our heart and everything runs on, so it will come to you, like that's how this shit works, you know, it's like the laws of the universe, that's just how it works. So, I don't know, I just think it's really about being of service and letting go of all of the attachments, all of the other things, all of the fear-based things, all of the external things, because those things that are supposed to be yours, that are supposed to come to you, will come to you anyway. So you don't need to worry and have all of that fear and all of that anxiety about those things, because they're already yours. You're worrying about something that's 
destined to be yours. <laughs> like, it's a part of you. It's meant to be yours. So what are you worrying about it for? Why are you worrying about how that goal is going to happen or when this right person is going to come to you or how this relationship is going to unfold, whether this person's going to stay loyal or cheat? Why are you worrying about that shit? Like, you're literally worrying about something that's predestined, it's going to plan and unfold exactly as you need. So let go of that worry. You don't need to worry about that outcome, you know? Or even how things will fall into place for you, or how, like, the tools that you need will come to you. Because they will align, because it's a part of your purpose. But if you can't hear your heart, and you can't hear what your purpose is, and you can't hear your truth and you can't hear like who you are then how will those things align for you because you won't even notice them when they do so yeah I'm just feeling like now is such a time to just be ourselves and just hear who you are and feel who you are and go and put that out into the world because it can never be wrong because it's you it's your purpose that is why you came here that is what you came here for so, yeah, I just want to, like, if I can inspire somebody to just follow their heart, then I feel like that's living my purpose, you know? And none of that, what I just said then about my purpose, none of that has anything to do with getting anything in return, anything to do with money, anything to do with success, anything to do with relationships, none of that, none of these external things has anything to do with what I just said about my purpose of this video. You know, like our purpose is an internal thing. It's fulfillment, it's being of service, it's leaving your mark on the world, it's having an impact, it's helping, it's elevating the collective through elevating yourself, you know? This shit is so much more powerful than what we're told and than what's fed to us, so yeah. I feel like this video is just another channeled message because I'm really in my feelings today. So we're just going to channel some random topics <laughs> that come up, you know, but I hope this helps in some way if you're like doubting yourself or you're questioning what the purpose of this life is, you know. It is just about hearing your own heart and that can never be wrong never be wrong because it's for you and only you can hear it and only you can feel it so even if somebody else tells you that it's wrong it isn't because it's your heart it's your truth and this is your experience so tap into what you love tap into why you would choose to come here and watch what happens you know watch how things unfold watch how things align for you and watch how new ideas just pop into your mind because you're hearing what feels right but yeah so thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already and check out the description box for all of my links to social media and my music and everything like that um, but also leave me any comments or feedback for these videos and any other topics that you want me to cover because I'm definitely like I want to help so if there's anything that you're going through anything that you want me to talk about and share my perspective on because obviously this is just my perception like that's what this world is you know we're helping people but you're helping people just through your own perception and your own interpretation and experience of things that you've been through you know we're sharing wisdom which literally is knowledge that you've then actually integrated and put into action and experienced so that is what this is so if there's anything I can share my perspective on that you're going through then definitely leave me a comment let me know and I will get to making those videos but thank you so much for watching I really really appreciate it like it means the world the amount of feedback that I've been getting and the amount of people that have been taking the time to watch and really like look at themselves you know it's all about the self so yeah but I'll see you in the next video thank you bye I need a man that will hold me down If he a yes man, I ain't keeping him around I need a